I remember I had my first annual review three months in just because of the timing of when I joined. And in that meeting, I just don't know what came over me. I basically said, I was like, I really enjoy this group and I enjoy working here, like, you know, in, in, in this capacity, but I am just letting you know that I have been reaching out aggressively to people in the front office to try and get into one of those roles. And the reason why I said that is just because I had just, I, I felt like I really needed to be honest with him, even though it was putting myself at risk. And it ended up working in my favor because he, he sort of laughed a little bit and he said, it doesn't happen that often, mm -hmm. but I truly respect your motivation. And he's like, if it does work out for you, that's great. And it also looks good on us because it shows what these can turn into. Right. And if it doesn't, then just like lesson learned. But he was just super supportive about it. And like looking back, it's like I would never tell somebody to do what I did. <laughs> but the fact that I did it just like it really, you know, it's just you're able to see that like, yeah, he cares about his group. But he also realizes like I'm a lower employee in his group. Like if I leave, it doesn't change that much. And it's not. A disrespect to his group it was just like i wanted to be able to take on and learn something new and different and he was just you know Did there he, should be more bosses there, and employees like him was there any pushback in terms of like okay fine you can do that but you got to be here for at least a year did he say anything around timing he's like mm -hmm. we can't just hire you and you jump six months later or, you know was there anything no like, i i think he was more like or he didn't think you would actually it's not gonna happen yeah yeah you know it's not gonna happen it was like if it does then like you deserve it <laughs> 